Do your colors always end up looking different after you export it from Premiere Pro? Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you the new quick and easy way to export your videos and make sure that your color looks the same. Here inside Premiere Pro, I have my footage out on the timeline and I've already color corrected and color graded it and I'm now ready to export the video. But if we want the colors to look the same way that they do inside of Premiere, when we export it, we need to change one setting. So we're gonna go up here to File and go down to Project Settings and select Color. And then we're going to go down here to viewer gamma and it should be at default set to 2.4 broadcast and that's because whenever premiere was originally created it was designed for videos to be posted on television but now they've added a few other options so we have 2.2 web and we have 1.96 quicktime i'm not really going to worry about 1.96 quicktime anytime you view things inside of a quicktime player your colors aren't accurately going to reflect what they were inside of Premiere anyways. So I recommend using something like VLC Media Player, which is a free media player option if you're gonna be viewing your videos after you export them. But anyways, what we're gonna do is we're gonna select 2.2 web. And this option is for anyone that's gonna be posting content on the web. So we're just gonna press okay. And then once you've selected that setting, you'll notice that especially in the shadows that they may have been raised slightly. So you will need to go back in and make those adjustments to get the dialed in look that you like. And then once you've done that, just export your video like normal. Now, for whatever reason, if your colors still look bad, you can add Adobe's gamma compensation LUT. I'll leave a link down in the description. It's free. You can add that to your export whenever you're exporting your video and that should solve your issue. To add their LUT, all you're gonna do is go up to the export tab and then select your export settings like normal and then go down here to the effects tab check the box for Lumetri look slash LUT, click down here, select custom, and then you're just going to click on their LUT that you've downloaded and it's going to add that to your export and then just export the video like normal. Just be careful if you're editing on a Mac because if you're watching your videos back after you've exported it using Mac's default player or a QuickTime player, it's not actually gonna be using the correct viewer gamma based off of the settings we just selected. So you're better off downloading something like VLC or just uploading your video to YouTube and then comparing that version on YouTube to what you have inside of Premiere Pro because that's gonna be displaying that correct 2.2 viewer gamma. If you'd like to learn more about how I export videos in high quality, check out this video next and I'll see you in the next one.